got this new truck tonight, and it is a laser nut, and it's supposed to go 50 miles an hour, and it is I guess it's a pretty good truck. I don't know. A car. I like the color of it, Wyatt. Uh, it's got two people in it, and they're all seat, and the speakers are all seat. Or those fans. Those are fans. Those are all radiators. All pretend, pretend, pretend people. The faces don't come off. These tires are really, really squishy. It's really pretty. These tires are really big. They're squishy. Looks like underneath is solid. I don't know how this sits up, but maybe, maybe here you can look at the motor. Oh, it's got like handles so these don't fall off on the ground. Hmm, that's nice. Uh, does that just pop up? Yeah. Oh, it's really clean. Look at that, Wyatt. Cool. So this has a, a new battery that I had never heard of. It, it The guy called, okay, so someone who isn't really familiar with remote control stuff. Which is you. Yeah. He says it's a, he's talking to my husband about, that one runs on some other kind of battery, and then some other numbers, and this and that, and I heard the word lipo, and I can't believe they use that word for a battery, but there we go. That takes <laughs> lipo battery, and it goes 50 mile an hour. On a 4S lipo. Yep, and we'll see how it runs. Wyatt's going to test drive it here in a little bit. Thanks, Wyatt, for opening it. Yep. Okay. okay. Just checking out the new laser nut here and really digging what it's got. It's got the... Spectrum D3 radio with the smart technology. If you use a smart battery, it'll tell you how much battery power you have left. Um, 130 amp Spectrum Firma ESC, 4S LiPo capable, Spectrum Servo. And I believe this is. What a, number is that servo? Uh, what? I don't know how many kilogram it is, but it is a decent servo for a stock servo. But then it's also got the Spectrum Firma brushless, and I believe this is a 2700 kV brushless motor. So on 4S, they say this thing will go close to 50 miles an hour. So definitely good performance. But I'm really digging it. Nice aluminum shocks. Steel drive shafts from the uh, center diff go to the front and rear diffs. It is open diffs. Is that steel? Are you sure? It's underneath there. Oh. There's a steel drive shaft. Oh yeah, I feel it. Yep. But it is open diffs, front and rear. Can you see that? Bigger. I have no idea what you're talking about, but yep. I'm taking a picture. Front and rear open diffs. Very nice. There's the people's butts. <laughs> They're yep. fake. 
There's no butts. Let's see. How do you shut this? Why is it stuck? I don't know, but don't break it. It's got like a stuck. Stuck. It's got like a stuck mode. How'd you fix that? You just gotta flip these arms back the other way so you can almost, if you pull them forward, you'll hold them up and then you just push them. Kind of like when you fold a ladder. Like a lawn chair? Like a, yeah, like a sort lawn of. Chair. And there are the people's faces. It's there got a nice. Are. They're half, they're half people. Carbon fiber looking paint job on it. They're like so sunken into the plastic. Look at them. Yeah. I wonder if their helmets come off. What is that tube? Well, it's just a fake, fake breather tube, air Gas tube for their helmet. For them? That's a cool touch. Why would they need that? Even if they were yeah. real, why would they need that? Huh? They, because when they drive these things, it's really dirty and dusty, so they need clean air so to use, breathe. They use a tube like that. Yeah, it filters clean air into their helmets. Real people do that. Yep. Like race car drivers. Yeah, this is actually modeled after a real vehicle that actually exists. Hmm. So that's the color we got. I think it's a cool color. Mm-hmm. It's got Carbon a neat, fiber. neat pattern on it. Yep, it's a carbon fiber look. It's got a light bar, a couple light pods here and there. Oh, does that really work? Yeah, that's real. Hmm. These do too. That'll be bright. Oh, man. I didn't see those lights. Yep, very cool. Can't Is there lights on the front? Get it out. Is no, that a no light? No lights on the front. No, that's not a light. Let's see if I can figure out how to put the rock lights on there. Well, uh, I don't see a place for him, no. so we'll talk about that later. <laughs> have to get creative on this one.